Hey folks, and welcome to this week's News and Community Spotlight. Are you ready to rock? Introducing the Unreal Engine World Tour. Our team of evangelists will be hosting sessions across the world, covering everything from upcoming features, the Epic ecosystem, resources, best practices, and more. See where they'll be and register today at unrealengine.com slash events. September's Marketplace sale is here, and over 1,500 products are on sale. Be sure to check out some of our favourites highlighted in the blog and head to the Marketplace to dive into the deals until September 25th. Ready to ask Unreal anything? Prep your questions on anything physics as we'll be joined by our outstanding members of the physics team. Join us on the forums on September 28th from 1pm to 3pm Eastern. Can sales configurators, XR Enhanced Design, and Digital Twins change the way we interact with real estate? In real time real estate, visualize, connect, and build, James Scott from the MIT Center for Real Estate talks with JLL Technologies and Immersa about the many ways technology is changing the industry. If you missed our latest episode of The Pulse, head to unrealengine.com feed to catch up. While there, check out the talent from India and Southeast Asia, as it is incredible. In May, we launched the second edition of our Women Creators program, partnering with Open Air Films, Asifa, and Perforce Software to provide women producers with an in-depth training and mentoring program. 21 finalists went even further, diving into everything from pre-visualization to world building with the help of Unreal Fellowship graduates. In our latest interview, we caught up with Reply Game Studios Game and Creative Director Fabio Pagetti on how the studio aspired to achieve something akin to Bayonetta, Devil May Cry, and Near Automata, and how the team came up with Solstice's unique game mechanics, grew the studio during a pandemic, and how being awarded an Epic Mega Grant propelled the studio and its team just at the right moment. Journey to the feed to learn more. Bringing prehistoric creatures into another universe is no easy task. Learn how Defola Animation Studio employs real-time animation on their South Korean hit series, Dino Powers. Utilizing control rigs that were compatible with their 3D DCC applications, Unreal Engine's world-building capabilities for their environments, and how blueprints helped automation that saved them time and money. Head to the feed for more details and check out the spotlight. Moving on over to this week's Community Spotlights, Put together in just four weeks and creating everything from assets, textures, and animation, John Gustafsson was inspired by their love of 90s TV series Moomin to create this picturesque environment. Cross over to their art station and let them know what you think of Moomin Valley. Danger, Dramatics, and the Unknown Alan Garita's sci-fi short film Guardian encompasses every one of those and more. Created in Unreal Engine 5 with fantastic visual effects and a well thought out atmosphere. Watch the short in full on their YouTube channel. Stepping out of your comfort zone and into the night is never easy. Technical artist Michael Girard did just that as they challenged themselves to create this blissful, Japan-inspired environment. With jaw-dropping scenic elements, we're sure you will all enjoy this as much as we have. Head to their art station and let them know what you think of Japanese Night. Thanks for watching. Catch you next week.